Smile Half Acre Homestead here. Uh, I just wanted to share another tip of the day. Don't throw away your old pickle jars. These things are invaluable. Um, if the lids are in good shape and the jars are in good shape, you can actually redo your pickles in them because it's not something you necessarily do in a boiling bath canner or that you're going to put in a pressure canner. Don't ever reuse commercial jars that you've bought in the store with food in them in your pressure canner. Not a good idea. Always use new lids and, and things like that. But for things like storing dehydrated food, um, these are some dehydrated strawberries that I did while they were in season. And if you want to, oh wow, that smells really good. Mmm, smells just like fresh strawberries. You wouldn't believe it. Anyway, um, you can, if you want to store this long term, something like uh, dehydrated strawberries, I have several jars. Uh, throw a, a, a 30 or a 50, sorry, a 50 cc oxygen absorber in here and lock it down tight. And if this is full, that will, that will keep for a really long time. Also, when we had our 69 hour power outage, candles in power outages are one of the biggest causes of houses burning down in power outages that last a long time. Um, I had some emergency candles and what I did was I took a little piece of beeswax and melted it on the bottom and I just stuck a candle in there and you have an instant storm lantern. Now, of course, you don't put it under anything like a wooden shelf or anything, but this is going to help cut down any breeze from your candle blowing out or your candle catching, uh, blowing and catching on curtains or whatever. And rather than take the candle out and wash the jar and put it away, just set these on your pantry shelf for, for emergencies. Anyway, Bev from My Half Acre Homestead with the tip of the day, don't throw away old jars. They come in handy.